is your friendly neighborhood Slip Gator here, and welcome to season three of Pooping Evolved. Yeah, that's that's how the intro would have gone if I didn't delete the footage from last night where we kicked off season three of Pooping Evolved. Yes, I uh, <laughs> I stayed up until about 5:30 a.m. last night, um, basically to record the starting of this new server. And I deleted the footage today when I went to edit it by accident. So yeah, it's really, really disappointing. But basically, this is where we began. We all kind of like sat around in one big circle. I'm going to try and imitate it. And I was like here and I was, you know, watching everyone. And I think Garrett was on my right and Wells Knight, I think, on my le left. And we had Monkey Farm and XP Crafted and Tiny Slip. We had Zuljan, we had Mazion, we had Drax. Oh, we had like everyone here. And one by one we got called up and we went over to this monument over here and basically chose our own tribe names. Now what you're probably wondering, what is going on with picking your own tribe names? Well, basically things are a little bit different this season. We're going to be going out on our own. Going solo. We're riding solo. We're riding solo, solo. Yeah, we're going solo. Um, and yeah, so as you can see, we got Doodoo. I can't remember whose that is. We got Zoe. We got... I can't even read that. Get rid of that stuff. Monkey Farm. The Monkey Farm, of course. We got... Oh, yeah. For now. I think that was Z. I think that was Zujins. I can't remember. We got the Destroyers. That's Drax, I believe. We got the Mercs. I can't remember who that is. We got the Knights of Noob. The Knights of Noob. Uh, who else? We got the Wanderers. This is me. This is us. This season, we are the Wanderers. And uh, we got the Amazing Excellence, Amazioning Excellence, that's Amazion, of course. We got Nomad Hype Life, that is Garrett and Blood Eagle. And then we got Cloco and Noom, I reckon that's Slip. But basically, yeah, let me, let me go over what is going on this season. It's kind of, I don't know, I sprung it on you guys. I wasn't around over Christmas, so I didn't get a lot of recording done. But yeah, this is basically what's going on. Everyone is going solo. What does that mean? Everyone is in separate tribe. What does that mean? We can't exactly work together anymore. What does that mean? There is going to be raiding. There is going to be pillaging. There is going to be betraying and alliancing and friendship. And it's, it's going to get pretty crazy. It's going to get pretty crazy. But yeah, so everyone's creating their own bases. We are able to raid each other and do all sorts of evil things to one another. Or well, we can become friends. I don't know what I'm going to be doing, but we just gained a level. So we should be like level 4 by now, right? Or level 5 even. And I'm going to upgrade movement speed again. So I've basically gone and gotten the essential tools together. we got our pickaxe. We've got our regular axe. And then we've got a spear. That's about it. We don't have any meat on us at the moment. But we've got a couple of... We've got a little bit of resources and stuff. Um, but yes... Let's have a quick look at the map. Now, a lot of places have already been, like, taken by members of the server. And I just realized I'm nowhere near where I want to be. We're kind of going for about 75-35. Where Menace and TDC were last server. And where is Santa Claus? Raptor Claus. I've never seen Raptor Claus before. I think he flies in the sky. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, that's where we're planning on going. So I'm thinking of going on a bit of an adventure down that way. Um, if we survive, awesome. If we don't, well, whatever. So yeah, we're going to head over in that direction. If we survive, which I don't know. To be honest, I'm kind of I'm kind of doubtful that we will. But whatever, right? Whatever. This guy here would be a very valuable source of food right now, though. And we're going to need meat pretty soon. There's a T-Rex down there. No, that's a Kano. That's a Kano down there. Where's this freaking Fiomia going? Buddy, come back here. Get your ass over here, son. Get your ass over here. Because I'm a wanderer. Yeah, a wanderer. I roam around, 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 around. I slay Fiomias. And I break my spears on them. I've got a little bit of hide and some meat. I got some stuff. And I got lots and lots of meat. More meat than I realized I was gonna have. There's a condo over there. We should probably go a different direction before it kills us. 
Because that's what will happen. I'm gonna go. There's an RG. Oh my god, there's so many things that already want to kill us. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna head up here. I'm gonna cook this meat. Maybe wait for daytime. And then we'll go on our adventure. Oh. Alright, so I got my meat cooking with some, some leftover spark powder. And check this out, alright? Whoever set this stuff up left a fair bit of spark powder around here. And I mean, it is every man for himself, this server. So what's to stop me from pocketing a little bit of this stuff? This will come in handy. I'm going to take 50% of this stuff. That way I leave a little bit for whoever else wants to come and, uh, you know, rub the joint of its stuff. <laughs> Don't tell anyone. Whatever you do, this is our little secret. Do not go telling the other server members. I swear, if I read in anyone else's comments, if I read all the comments of anyone else's video, God help me. I will be quite upset. Look at all this. Actually, ooh, is this a good idea? Is this a good idea? Because now that I think about it, we're probably going to die. We're probably going to die. I know what we should do. Let's... Actually, can we? Can we get armor? Let's get armor. Alright, so we can land the Engrams for like the full set of cloth armor, which is cool. And a water skin. We're going to need water pretty soon as well. Um, oh gosh, it's windy. It is windy. And a slingshot. We're going to need that as well. <gasps> we don't have enough points. I've never felt what it's like to not have points. That's really weird. That is a weird feeling, but whatever. We should have enough to get like a full set of this, I think. So we've got our boots. We've got our little wrist guards. Uh, yeah, that's everything. Cool. So, we're set for cloth armor for now. Oh my god, it's such a step back. I forgot what it's like to play this like low-level game where you gotta start from scratch with cloth again. I was used to like journeyman level like flak armor and stuff, but oh, this is just weird. This is just weird. Alright, so we're good. We're good. I'm going to take a little bit more food. We've got seven. I'm gonna get a little bit more. Hmm. I forgot this stuff is in here. I did indeed. Now, since we are doing this whole tribal thing, I should probably distinguish myself from the others, right? And I think I should paint my armor right away. I ain't... Oh, snap. I don't want to do that. I want to paint it. There we go. That's better. Okay. So, 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 so. We're going for the colors like red and yellow, right? So, we can go red, orange, or yellow like that. Yellow there, there, or there. Um, I think we should go like a full red t-shirt. I reckon the straps are going to go yellow. I think the, the braiding stuff is going to go yellow. And that is going to go yellow as well. There we go. Okay. Now... Let's also paint up our leggings. What are we going to go? We're going to go... We're going to go red as well. I think. Or... What else can we do? Can we go blue or black? Let's have a quick look at this. I want to see what it looks like. I want to see what it looks like. If we go black pants... Yeah. Or blue. They're kind of like jeans. Let's go black. We're going to go black. Uh, the bottom parts, bottom parts are going to go red, the leg, that part there is going to go red, the little bag part, it's going to stay as it is, five, the little knee pads, knee pads, they're going to go black, and the belt of course is going to go black, of course it is, now we've got boots, boots of course are going to go black as well. And what else have we got? We've got our gloves that are... Okay, apparently they're going to go black too. And our hat. I guess... Yeah. Alright, how's this look? Yep. 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 We look good, baby. We look good. Let me go put all this paint back for whoever wants it next because I don't really need it. So let's dump that. We match our colors. We've got it all together. Do we have any more food to bring with us? We have exactly... 
that much food. And I'm gonna leave a little bit extra for whoever comes next. There we go. Alright. Yeah, I'll leave that too. Cool. We got 200 spark powder. We got a bunch of other stuff. We got enough food that should be enough to survive. Can we get ourselves maybe another spear? We need wood. Okay. Okay. So, we're gonna have to get some wood. We're gonna have to create some spears because that's our only real defense right now. Um, and we're gonna have to avoid anything that can kill us. I believe we're going to be heading in that direction. I think that's the ocean over there. So let's go on our way. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I'm pretty freaking scared. I can see a dinosaur right there, in fact. And I reckon that's one of those, those egg-stealing raptors. And I don't really know what they're capable of. So I'm gonna avoid him. Like the plague, because I've got a feeling that could only go bad. So let's get these spears right there. Okay, we're good, we're good. Things are good. So, I'm actually going to get my spear out, just in case something decides to rush up on us and attack us. And it looks like we're going to go down this little slippery dip. Oh. And damage ourselves, of course. Is that a, that's a Bronto. Okay, cool, cool. So... We just need to be very careful and aware of our surroundings. That's number one priority. We got a... Ooh. He's taking damage from something. How are these guys looking? <gasps> oh, how you going, Megaloceros? It's a female. She doesn't have any horns on her. There's the male. Ooh, it's an albino one too. He looks kind of cool. He's level 20. That is nice. I want one of the... Oh, it's one of these little suckers. It's one of these little suckers. Could he be our first kill? Or will this be our first death? Has he seen us? What's he doing? Oh, he's attacking the compy. Those compies. You know what? We're going to stay away from the compies. Compies are bad news. Compies can kill you so quickly, you would not know what happened. So we're staying well clear of that. We've got an Ankylo. There's a lot of Stegos around here. What else have we got? Another Fyomia. Oh my god. This is good. This is good. we got a massive piece of shit. I'll leave that right there where it belongs. <gasps> oh, the little penguin! The little penguin! What's up, little man? Oh, insects. we got insects already. We're going to leave them. We're going to leave them. I ain't in a hurry to go messing with them. Cool. So we found the river. Rivers, in my opinion, are generally pretty safe. Um, unless you come across an Alpha Raptor or something. You get a lot of Dialos. Is that a Dialo? No. That's one of those Procoptic Omniraptor. It's an Oviraptor, level 8. I'm not too concerned with taming one of them. Or killing one. I'll probably just let him live. <laughs> Are we going the right way? I think we are. It appears we are. So that's cool. Okay, cool. We're on our way from misery to happiness today. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. I'm on my way from what I want to be supposed to be. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. And every way we we'll take you to the next world. And yes, from now, there's a dialogue in front of us. What level is he? I wish I had a spyglass. Is any other? Oh, she's level 60. Okay. We do not want to get hit by this little freaking piece of shit. We do not want to get hit by this guy. Why are we lagging? I don't want to lag right now. He dead. He dead. He dead. He is dead. How does it feel being my first carnivorous kill? My first carnivore kill. Oh, that feels good. That feels good. Ripple. It's a ravey. Oh, he's stuck. He's stuck. Is he stuck? I'm going to kill him for the experience. Oh, Compi. You, are you alright? You don't have any friends with you, right? I'm going to kill you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know how much health you guys have, but it's got to be done. I broke my spear on this little freaking piece of shit. Oh! Oh, it's a freaking insect. Oh, it's like, what is attacking me now? Get out of here, you little 
The Magnamura thing. All right, he dead, he dead. Now, I just want to kill this guy. Is that too much? Oh, he's free. He's free. No, he's not. He's too stuck. He's too stuck. He's too stuck. There he goes. There he goes. All right, so it's all about the experience, baby. It's all about the experience. Now, I'm going to up my melee damage now. So we've got two points on melee damage, and we've got three points on movement speed. That's cool. That's cool. That's uh, pretty good for early game. That's exactly what you want for early game. So we're looking a fabulous... Oh, alpha Raptor. There's an Alpha Raptor. That's exactly what I was saying. I don't want to come across. Alpha Raptors. Bad news. Bad news. Bad news. Alpha Raptors. I'm very bad news. Stay the hell away. I'm gonna do a poo. Leave me the hell alone. There's a raptor over there. Two raptors over there! I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving them alone. Leaving the world alone! There's a little compy here. Oh, it's a little lady. Little lady. I'm staying away from the compies. If, uh, if you get multiple compies chasing you, they want to mess you up. So you do not want to have multiple of them following you. Because, uh, yeah. On their own, they don't attack when there's like a bunch of them together. Oh, you screwed, son. You screwed. Looks like there's another. There's a lot of those Ubi Raptors. I've never seen them before. But there are so many of them. Hmm. I wouldn't mind building up here. This is a really nice spot. Very nice spot. Hmm. I don't like it. I don't like it. We're not gonna stay here. We're moving on. Moving on up. Except we're gonna go a different way. Because if we keep going that way, I got a feeling we're not gonna survive very long. Especially with all those raptors over there. From my noobish experiences playing this game, the beach tends to be the place I die the least. It's where you get a lot of brontos, you get a lot of, like, just things that don't want to kill you. What is attacking me? Oh, it's another freaking daily. Leave me alone! Oh, snap, that ain't good. No! It all happened so quick! And I fell through the world as well! Oh my god! Oh my god. What the hell? Oh wow. Someone's already been busy. Someone has made a bridge to cross this. Oh, there's a house over there. There's a house over there. Someone's building a base over here. It's tiny. It's tiny. <laughs> I don't know if we should bother looking for our stuff. I mean, it is dyed to our colors and everything, and it's looking all beautiful and special. But I'm pretty sure we fell through the ground, so I don't, I don't know if there's any point. <sighs> you know what? I think it's time we teleport across the map. What have we got to lose? Let's do it, Kano. Send me to heaven, baby. Send me to heaven. We're going to spawn in West Zone 1 right over here, right next to where I want to be building my base. So fingers crossed things go a little better for us over there. I think things are going to go wonderfully. Ooh, is a gold beacon drop. Too bad we can't pick it up. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this is like right where I'm going to be building, in fact. I'm pretty sure it's right up on this mountain top. So hopefully... There ain't no spinos around, because I know that this is like heavy spino spawning territory. This little lake here. I've seen a fair few spinos here in my time. In fact, if you remember episode one of season two, we encountered quite a deadly spino with uh, my mate J-Rod. But uh, it looks like we're good today. It looks like we're good. So, this is where we're heading. Up atop of this little plateau. This is what I've got an idea for. I'm not 100% sold on it yet because it is a very big area. And I'm not too sure. It is... Mm, I don't know if a big base is the best option for this server. I'm thinking small bases and a lot of them. That way you can kind of move around a lot. So this is kind of the area that I had in mind, guys. It's a nice little, like, clearing. It kind of looks shitty with all the snow, but it looks nice when it's not snowing. Um, 
it's a nice little clearing. In fact, it's probably a little bit too big for what we want it for. Hmm. We might need to reevaluate our thinking on this one. It's not quite what I had in mind. Huh. Definitely not what I had in mind. Let's hurry up and use this level. Let's throw it onto stamina. Because we seem to be going through a hell of a lot of stamina. All right. <gasps> Ooh. Someone's been building down there. I wonder whose that is. I wonder whose that is. Hmm. You know what, guys? I think this would be an amazing spot. It's nice and hidden. We're nice and camouflaged. I think this is where we're going to build our initial little kind of makeshift, makeshift house. This is where we're going to be building. If only I can find some rocks. Where are the little rocks at? I need to pick up some rocks before I can do anything. Why are there no rocks on the ground? There should be a lot of little rocks on the ground. Where are the rocks at? They're probably underneath all of the freaking stuff. All the stuff. Stuff and things. Uh, what do we got? We need some tools. We're going to need some wood and some thatch. One piece of wood. Ten pieces of thatch. Easy done. Give me that wood, baby. There it is. There we go. All right. So we've got our pickaxe back. <gasps> Woo! This is what we needed. Stones. Stones for days. Well, guys, I think it's time to wrap up this video. I hope you enjoyed it. This is going to be an amazing season. It's going to be a lot more exciting and a lot more crazy than the other one. I'm, I'm honestly predicting some, like, true Game of Thrones shit going down. I'm talking pillaging and killing and betraying and yeah I, it's gonna be crazy guys but thank you so much if you are as excited as i am for this season make sure to hit that thumbs up on this video and let me know down below if you have any ideas for things that we should do because it's gonna be a lot of it's gonna be it's gonna be interesting it's gonna be interesting and i want to hear what you guys have to say but that is all guys peace out i love you always i will see you in another video tomorrow where we're gonna start building a little base here that is all. Bye for now.